हेलो एवरीवन आई एम सोनम फ्रॉम पैबली टीम एंड टुडेज टॉपिक इज रजिस्टर यूजर्स फ्रॉम लीड स्क्वेड सीआरएम लर्निंग पेज टू योर जूम वेबिनार ऑटोमेटिकली सो द आइडिया हेयर इज वेन एवर सम वन इज गोइंग टू रजिस्टर फ्रॉम द लर्निंग पेज ऑफ योर लीड स्क्वेड सी आर एम रजिस्टर द सेम यूजर टू द वेबिनार ऑफ योर जूम ऑटोमेटिकली so let's understand it with an example this is my zoom account and i have created a webinar in my zoom account now i have created a landing page also in my lead squared crm for collecting the registration of my webinar okay now i want that whenever someone is going to register from this landing page of my lead squared crm the same user will be automatically registered to my this crm okay as a registrant you can see there are two registrant and i want whenever someone is going to register from here the person should be automatically add as a registrant in my zoom application but there is no direct connection in between lead squared and zoom that is why i am going to take help of integration and automation software pabli connect so just watch this video and and you will also understand how you can actually build these kind of automation these kind of connections type p a b b l y pabli.com/connect in your browser and press enter and you will reach to the landing page of our automation software now from this blue button create your free account the account creation is absolutely free and you will also get 100 free task to test this kind of automation now i am signing in because i already have an account and i have reached to the dashboard click on access now and this is the dashboard of pabli connect okay and you need to click on this blue button in order to start creating your workflow your automation so i am giving any random name so let's give the name as lead squared crm to zoom application okay zoom app all right let me correct this spelling okay it is correct now lead squared crm to zoom application click on create and you will find two boxes in front of you these are actually trigger and action trigger means when this happens action means do this so basically our automation is going to work on these two principles let's understand with it with an example when a sale happen in a payment gateway application send an email via gmail let's say when a form is submitted google forms share a file via google drive applications according to our use case when the landing page is submitted of lead squared crm register the user in zoom application so let's begin with the process and our first step is actually connecting lead squared crm with pabli connect okay so let's search for this application lead squared first okay and choose the trigger event and my trigger event will be landing page submission okay once i have selected the trigger event you will get a webhook url and some set of instructions simply copy this webhook url and follow these instruction in order to build up the connection in between lead squared and pabli connect so i have copied this url and i am going to my lead squared account here you will have to click on this settings option okay and once you will click on settings at the left hand side you will find the option of api and webhooks click on that and here the webhook option will be visible okay you'll have to click on this option then click on this create button okay and select the event the event will be my event will be landing page submission for now i am actually untick this because i want on the submission of particular landing page only i want to capture the data so i'll have to enter the landing page url also so let's open up our landing page so this is the marketing and here you will find all the landing pages and let me show you my landing page which i have created for collecting the webinar registrations here it is so my uh, landing pages is php dead so the topic of my webinar is actually going to be the same and uh, this is the landing page url okay let's copy the url okay and paste it over here all right
now it is asking for webhook url where i will find the webhook url remember i have actually received the webhook url from the public connect simply copy it and paste it here the http is already given here select the https and remove it from this particular url okay so it has actually removed automatically select the content type as application js and now click on save all right and you can see the webhook is added successfully now come back to public connect and see what is return over there okay so the response has not received i am going to click on this recapture button okay and let's see what is return over there log into the application where you have added the webhook url and do a test submission or record so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response so what i'll have to do is to i will open my landing page here it is and i am going to register as a dummy user here okay so that pabli connect will actually capture the data and this is how we are going to build the connection okay so for in the first name i am adding the name as testing and uh, in last name testing name the email address is admin at the rate pabli touch dot com again okay and in number also i am adding I have added just a dummy number and country code as well. Now I am clicking on submit and let's come back to Pabli Connect and see whether the data has been captured or not. Waiting for the webhook response, and you can see the response is received. And let me see the values actually. Okay, you can see here is the email ID. here is the first name here is the last name the phone number every detail is here so that means the first step of our integration is actually done now let's move to our next step so basically i want to register the user who has just registered from the landing page of a lead squad crm to my zoom webinar automatically so that is why i am going to choose zoom application here okay click on zoom and in the action event it will be actually add a webinar registrant this is going to be my action event click on connect and click on add new connection and once you will click on connect with zoom it will be asking you the credential of zoom i already logged in in my zoom application so you will see that it will be connected automatically you can see the authorization is successful now it is asking to fill some details so the very first detail is the webinar so basically my webinar is is php dead in 2022 let me even show you my zoom account that whatever the webinars are available in my zoom account has started visible here because i am now connected okay let me show you my zoom application you can see this is my zoom account and this is the webinar future of php and several other webinars are also visible is php dead in 2022 future of php and let's come back to public connecting you can see the webinars and the meetings are actually visible here i am going to select this particular webinar because i want to register the people here only now email address so basically the email id of the person to whom i need to register in zoom webinar from where i will get that email address I will get that email address from the response of my lead squad CRM. Well, I do not have to actually copy the details and paste it here. Simply click on this field, and you will find the all the details of lead squad CRM. Basically, the response which we have just received here in the drop down only, and simply click on that email ID. Where is that email ID? Here it is. click here and you will see it will be mapped now mapping is really very interesting in pabli connect whatever the values i am going to map are going to change automatically if i am going to write something manually it will not change but if i am going to map something here it will be changed automatically on every new submission all right same with happen with name also let's map it the first name is okay Here is the first name the testing the last name is actually the name only let me map it again all right last name last name last name okay here is the last name 
and what is next basically the phone number of the person so let's map the phone number also okay again map the phone number here is the phone number I have mapped in now simply click on save and send test request and I am expecting that the user has added to my webinar ads registrant automatically right after creating right after clicking on this button okay the response has been received let's check my zoom account okay and let me check my uh, webinar okay and let's see what are the registrants available in this particular webinar okay who has registered for this webinar okay you can see the webinar size is 500 where are the people well there are three registrants okay i'm going to edit it and let's see admin at the rate public yes you can see the person as testing name and the person admit at the rate pablitards.com which we have registered via the landing page has been ordered has been added automatically so this is how you can actually build up the connection in between lead squared crm and zoom account automatically with the help of pabli connect and not just the, these two application one can integrate different kind of application under pabli connect and create several kinds of automation if you found the video helpful like it and share your queries in the comment box me and my team will surely help you thank you for watching this video